Hey guys, what's up? So, uh, I've been getting a lot of questions about uh, AppCake for firmware version 3.2.1. Um, and just so that you all know, uh, it does not work on 3.2.1. Um, I have somebody said something about it being updated, but I don't really care. Um, I liked AppCake because AppBeload didn't work or install this didn't work. And then the reason I didn't like it was because it didn't uh, sync your apps into your iTunes. So it was really annoying, but um, a new installus or installius or however you want to call it has been released, um, and I have the repo in front of me. Um, I'm going to show you guys how to get it, and then um, if you guys don't know how to use installus, uh, just kind of figure it out. It's really not hard, but I'm not going to show you because it can get me in trouble. And um, honestly, uh, I really don't use too many cracked apps. Um, because I do support developers. I mean, I'm, I'm only 17, but I still buy apps uh, with my own money out of my pocket. And uh, you guys should too. I mean, it doesn't take much to go and buy an iTunes card or get a credit card or something like that. Or even a, a debit card, like I have. Uh, but, um... Like, obviously there's some apps out there that are ridiculous, like 40 50 couple hundred dollars. That's totally different because that's ridiculous. I don't have a couple help. I don't have money like that. Like if I spend, I spend probably around five to ten bucks every like month, maybe if that on apps. But um, uh, so you guys should definitely support the developers. But if you absolutely need to use them, then uh, I'm gonna show you how to get the program on your or the app on your iPod Touch to do that for version 3.2.1. Okay, here's the repo. As you notice, it is just cydia.installus.com. Um, obviously, you can see right there that O is a zero and not just a regular old O. So, um, let's go into the iPod Touch and let's add this. So, you go into Cydia, you go into Manage down there, you click Sources right there, Edit, Add, and you just add it in. I'm going to do this real quick right now because I still have not done this. Now the, um, in the description will be the full uh, source, so you can just read it off of that. So let's update the source. Do 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 And there we go, reloading data. Just click return to Cydia. having a first gen iPod Touch. Hopefully I'll be getting a new one from uh, Lockers. I actually have enough points in Lockers to get a new iPod Touch. They just need to restock. So, if you guys want an invite to that, um, go ahead and PM me. It's going to be right there. It's going to be where my thing is, or it's going to be down there. Just click on my name um, and go to my page and send me a PM. And please do subscribe while you're at it. So once you have the source in there, there it is. It's kind of hard to read, but there you go. Then it's going to changes. It's going to be the first one. Install this. Install it, obviously. Uh, da, 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 da. And then confirm. It's going to install it. Probably going to ask you to refresh your springboard. And then you are all set and ready to go. <laughs> Guess not. Hopefully it's on the springboard. If not, all you have to do is refresh your uh, iPod or iPhone. <coughs> Let's go and 
find it. Alright, well obviously all you have to do then is just respring your uh, avatar touch, which is uh, what I'll do. I'll respring it, and um, that'll be it. So, that is uh, pretty much it for this video, guys. This is how you get cracked apps on firmware 3.1.2. Um, if you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below. Please rate this video 5 stars, and please do subscribe. Um, I'm really starting to get up there with some subscribers. I got 235 right now, I believe, which is pretty awesome. Um, if you guys get up to 250, I'll be doing another giveaway. And uh, that's pretty much it. So I will see you guys soon with a new video. Peace.